Ah, just admiring the view. But it's time to get back to things. Uh, okay, Glitch Reaper here. I'm back for some more Magic and Mythos. And I'm just hanging out at the lost city of Jezahar before I do something possibly incredibly stupid. <laughs> uh, because uh, there's still a possibility of this going horribly wrong. Uh, but I'm, I'm really hoping it doesn't come out of it. The thing is, I do have enough Omethal Essence from all the uh, uh, minions of the Gatekeeper that I attacked. But again, they require Omethal Ghoul Flesh, which I do not have, but I did have a pretty good idea of how to get it. The thing is, I can make dirt however much I want, because I have plenty of EMC. I'm, I'm good with that. So let's... Uh, Let's just take a stack of dirt there, okay? So, stack of dirt. Uh, but the other thing I need to do is I need to transmute it into Cursed Earth. And I only have one drop of evil to do that with. Drops of evil, as you might see clustered here with uh, other uh, Wither Skeleton items, it can only be obtained by Wither Skeletons. So, this means if I unleash this, I'm out that. Now, I can go back to my... Nether fort and do some wither skeleton hunting. That's that's a definite thing I can do, but I don't know how well that's going to go. Uh, I'm thinking probably actually pretty well. Just it'll take a little while to get everything all together. Why did I fly that even for a while? I don't have my yeah I don't have my uh, my ring on, so maybe I just glided particularly. Okay, that was just odd. Because <laughs> normally my flight isn't that even in this armor. So, that was surprising. Okay, my plan is to... It, it kind of happened again. I'm kind of just hovering there. The suit isn't meant to hover. Well, whatever. I mean, it's kind of nice for a change. I, I, to, it's usually my... Has it always been where I could do it that way? Because I don't think so. Hmm. Must have been a uh, little change they did at some point. Oh well. Uh, I've always used superhero mode flight with this. Uh, but anyhow, <clears throat> as I was going to say, I'm going to do this. I'm going to uh, do this where I make all this into cursed earth. It will spread quickly and it does not like sunlight. But in this dimension, do you see a sun? No. We should be clear on that one. So, I think we're going to be good on this front. Very good on this front. So, yeah. And afterwards, I'm going to have a field day accelerating. Because I'm going to accelerate the living tar out of this. Let me see here. I want you to be flat, not to be... Oh no. Don't, don't, don't tell me that, 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 uh, disintegrated it. I mean, I can make more, but still, I just don't like wastefulness. It's just a thing. I can't stop that. Yeah, according to this uneven amount, I... It counted me as having dug one, apparently, in a way of which the skill uh, effect triggered, and it probably gave me an item that's somewhere around here. Yeah, I, I, I literally started right at the point that I'd left, so I hadn't cleared all that up yet. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, wait, nope, nope, it went in here. That's yeah, good. Okay, okay, it's just the way I saw that whenever it broke kind of got me to ponder. Okay. Okay, so let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so I need a two more. Because I'm doing an eight by eight. It should spread fairly quickly once I unleash this. Okay. Here's a drop of evil from me. Okay. That make tracks? 
I am liking the new, uh, new way it hovers. Hello? Is there literally no spawning of one with all ghouls here? Because I th I'm wondering if it's really broke. Um, like, hello? I want to update my Necronomicon to its final form. Let me see. It was the uh, Necronomicon. Then it was the Abyssal Wastelands ne Necronomicon. Then it was the Dreadlands Necronomicon. Yeah, this would be fourth form. Uh, so, yeah, that reference is almost right. <laughs> uh, so, okay. Please be... Okay, maybe I need to give it a little distance, because mob spawning properties, but usually this also lets them spawn in closer. Hmm. Let me see here. What's it saying? I'm an Omethal. It's saying that, let me see, block light, block light, where are you, block light? It counts it as full sky, but not technically sunlight? This is weird. Okay. Um, I'm going to have to, uh, l let me see here. Do I, oh yeah, I did do that recently. I see, I think I have better builder's wands in here, so. Or do I? I don't? Huh. I have that builder's wand. Building tool. Nope, that's not what I need. Builder's wand, uh... Mm hmm. Okay. Boost max enchanting. Okay. So I can use magical wood and this. Magical wood was that. And that. Okay. I don't know if I absolutely have to use a regular crafting table, but I can try to use my like like my internal one. So I'll just take a couple of bookshelves, a couple of gold ingots, because I'd like to uh, try this out. I'll need another gold ingot just for the tip, because it is a wand. Okay, so... Can I do that in here? Yeah, I can. I have plenty of levels, so I'm, I'm good on that front. Okay, so... So I can even do that quick crafting, normally. Builder's Wand, okay. Because I want to make this into a room, because apparently it also needs low light level. So let's see what I got in the terms of bricks. Hmm, I could make it out of that, maybe. Do I have, like, brick blocks? Really? I, I don't have, like, straight up brick blocks, which would show very well around here. Okay, so let's uh, let's get straight up brick blocks. So let's make a brick house. Literally, let's just make a brick house. Okay, I think if I remember right, how this particular builder's wand works is I place a block, I click it. And then it knows what block I'm using. So, let's see here. Oh, nope. Okay, so it is extending. Okay, good, good. I'll, I'll need to break these bricks here so that I can extend. Just double that or something? I don't think it did, but it just seems like it did. Okay, so I'm placing just a few that way because it doesn't do the extension thing immediately. Okay, because what I need to do is I need to kind of arc this over. Okay, then 
I need to extend a line because I want to create kind of a, a nice roof. There we go. Okay. There's nothing coming out here. Okay, let me check the block light level while I'm here. Okay. It says 12. Okay, I need to close it off more. That's fair. Okay, so I need to close this off more. Probably have just like a little spot to just kind of zip in. And then that would work. Okay, so let's close it out a little bit here and there. Make it more effective for that. Okay, so I'm going to extend the line. If I get attacked by anything, I'll know it's probably what I need. <laughs> so that would actually be kind of... Oh, come on now. Uh, it, it flickered. It just went the wrong way. That's right, even the Red Morning Star suffers from the penalty of while you're flying, it actually slows down enough to actually notice it. Even if it's just for like a single like delay tick or two. So it may be great, but even it isn't perfect. Okay, so let's let's enclose this completely. So let's finish off the enclosure. And then I will be able to, uh, nope, nope, I want you to just do the, uh, the underhang, please. Okay. Ah, I'm hearing them now. I just had to enclose it more completely. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay, it works. It works. I just need to ensure. You're not what I wanted. I wanted an Omethal ghoul, not a... You just perish. Because I, I don't need... I don't need an Omethal... Uh, I don't need an Omethal Shogoth. I need an Omethal Ghoul. I can always repair that later, but if I'm really close... I don't think they'll fully go in. It's also, whenever that happened... Oh, he also... wasn't just me, he also broke some of the wall, so, uh, yeah. Uh-oh. I didn't mean to do that. Um, caution, shovel too fast. Oh, red morning star. So I'll have to punch it. I just wanted, I uh, see I'm getting things. Luckily, these boots are indestructible. <laughs> kind of. Well, they're considered unbreakable. They're not, like, truly indestructible, but they, they, they're they pretty far along there. So I don't have to worry about the ooze taking away my boots. There, it's spread again. Okay, so let's uh, just try this again. Uh, this time, without the Shogoth would be nice. Of course, there are other blocks I could use, some of which are probably less destructible by Shogos. So, here's hoping. Maybe I do need to seal it every time. Like, hello, please. 
I just need one Omethal ghoul. That's all I'm asking for. <sighs> okay. I'm getting where this is going. So, because of that, I think I'll just have to fight Jazahar, come back, and hope Omothal ghouls have shown up in the meantime. That, that's probably what I'm going to have to do. I have some good weapons. I have my Eternal White, which I might as well rename at some point into Eternal Slicer, because I do think that does sound better for this particular combo. So, I might do that. And, uh... I have my, well, my Builder's Wand is obviously not what I'm going to need to use here. Uh, but it is a nice, nice tool. But I also have my Red Katar. And I've got some really good armor on. I, oh, that reminds me, I need to make sure to have this repaired because Shogos, uh projectiles do bounce off of it, but it also counts against its durability. So there is that. Hmm. The curse of the earth does not always fully get what you want in Omothal. Uh, okay, maybe there's Omothal ghouls down there in the Dark Realm. That is a possibility. And I do technically have... Uh, I think I have a noted in here. Let's see, do I... Did I swap that out? No. Okay, so that, that that that's okay. I I have it somewhere. I think I have uh this city on my uh my general alchemical stuff. I mean my general uh inter stuff. Yeah, there it is. So I have Jazhar city here. So I can come back here anytime I need after I just swap that out for one of my locations. So I I'm good on that front. So I should be ready to go. Uh, let me see here, just in case. Maybe it's time to... Wait, did, did I have... Did I put up my... Oh, there it is. I thought I'd put it there. Okay, because... Well, I might try with my other weapons and stuff first. Uh, actually, I might prepare to have this on hot swap. See, that's okay on its own thing. I need to have at least some food. So I think... Wait, I heard something. But is it the something that I'm looking for? I don't 100% know, but I've got to try. What are you down there? Another... another lesser Shogoth. Like, seriously? We're not what I need, okay? It's just not what I'm after. I'm after Omothal ghouls, please. It's just... Oh, did I... Oh, no, I think that was from before. Okay. They're not being very workable there, although I do get Omothal uh, Shogoth flesh, which is nice. Shadow Fragment... Anything else I can EMC off the bat? That would be good to? Well, the Sulfur. Okay, tossing things in. Okay, get the bricks back. So I need a couple of them. Wait, was there more broken again? No, this time it only did that. So, I just need to replace a couple. Wait, was there an Omethal Ghoul in there? That would be nice if. Let me check that. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Meant to do that here. Okay. Shadow okay, so there's shadow creatures are showing up. 
but I haven't heard any ghouls yet. And there's supposed to be some Omethol ghouls that I'm after, and I'm not finding them. I think I'll just let this accelerate itself on its own, and I'll go face Jazhar. So, yeah, I'll 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 be I'll be back to that one at some point. Unless I obviously see something along those lines, which would be nice. Okay, whoa, I, I overshot. I overshot by a lot. <laughs> Omethal is suddenly punishing me with lag. Okay, okay. Okay, need to stabilize my position. Need to find, oh, hi, hi everybody. Sorry about this uh, buzzing around, but it, it, it happens. I shot so far past the temple. Okay. Eee. Okay. Stabilize. There we go. Need to use the new version that it actually works this way. <laughs> Rather than the old way. Okay, so let's let's do this. I've got plenty of extra health. And I know where my entrance is. I know where Jazahar should be. Just having issues with finding Omethal ghouls. Is it too much to ask? Can I get the appropriate ghoul around here, please? It's just... It's just one little detail. Okay, I got that... Uh, what's there? Oh, yeah. Riot shield. Okay, so that's that way. Remember that. Oh yeah, I needed to go up and around. And then central should be that way. Okay. Omethal is just a lot laggier this first. Whoa! More of these guys. How did I not fight you three before? Did you actually just spawn here? Whoa, lag spike. Big lag spike. Having flashbacks. To think before everything was fine whenever I, uh, uh, well, I did kind of get some more memory dedicated, but I think Omethal is just laggy in this version in general. And I will extract as much essence as I can before, fight before fighting Jazahar, because I haven't seen many of these guys around otherwise. So therefore, it will go down this way. Also, I kind of needed more to do better upgrades and get more stuff later, so might as well do that now. And these are the ones I get the elder scales from. They don't look that scaly, but I don't know. I guess in their arms and legs. I mean, they have some they have some good tentaglitch there, but it's just uh, you know they, they they just don't have many scales on like their main body. I guess they got scales where they got scales, so you know just a different body design. It's fine. <laughs> Every species is a tad different. Doesn't have too much knockback, but it kind of works. Here we go. And sometimes they get out of it, even though there's a bit of knockback. Because I clearly, I just kind of kept it at the same angle and it somehow jittered out. And I don't think you can use this on a boss. <laughs> I don't think you can rend a boss. Uh, at least I don't think so. That would be kind of crazy. <laughs> Could you imagine a, a, a special challenge trying to defeat one of the Abyssal Craft bosses using nothing but a staff of rendering? <laughs> or rending. Hey, it renders, it rends, it does it all. Especially the next staff, that'll be cool. Okay. That would be the craziest way to get Jazahar's attention. It's like, hey, I'm, I'm rending you from over here. <laughs> I don't think it'll work, but in a way, I'm kind of curious. 
I don't see any other attendants. But I do have his attention. Hi. I saw that coming. Wonk. Okay, you got reach. And this armor is not as invincible as it used to be. So I have concern. Although right now it's handling pretty well. Did I hit that into your face? Oh, I'm, be I'm being vibrated like crazy. I don't... I, I, I didn't sign up for that. Sorry. Congratulations, you killed me. No, not even close. You can't kill a great old one. What you killed was a simulacrum, a mere physical incarnation of infinite darkness. Some call it a puppet. Madness is a... Uh, something that escapes hum human when they delve into madness. Is oh, this is a little too fast. Uh, you may wish to pause this at several moments, because he has a pretty good speech. It just needs to be slowed down. Even my lip problem means this would be very difficult to read very quickly. Either way, I just need to maintain being back here while he self-destructs. And I get the item that I need. Yeah, that. Okay. Whoo! And here's the part me and Shino talked about. Uh, the self-destruct erases blocks, so we were trying to... I was trying to help him realize that there was a slight problem, because if uh, something went wrong, and you had to do the ritual to resummon him, what would happen if he had nuked the ritual site right here in the first place? Because you really need that item, like right there. Yoink. So... If you had somehow missed that, and he had destroyed this, how would you get it? So, uh, me and him discussed it, and he's, in later versions, I think he has put a special protection on this exact altar site. So, yeah. So just a little insight into how things could go wrong, and how in the future at least it's protected. It may already be in this version. So just say. And yeah, he's worth a ton of experience, because I know I just used some, and I'm back to 60 levels. But I need this. A lot. Uh, let me see here. To use this, I need to get my Omothal Necronomicon, which I'm waiting for the Omothal Ghouls of. Thank you very much. And with this, I'll be able to upgrade my Dreadland Staff of Rendering. Our lips. And it takes, yes, as you guessed it, Omothal Ghoul Flesh. And it has to be done with at least an Omothal Necronomicon. But, and th that's to upgrade it there. Uh, and then I'll upgrade this one into the Staff of Javzahar, which has its name a little problematic and requires the Abyssal Nomicon. Uh, the previous one, and a few things including uh, Chikoris Relay and Gateway Key. But don't worry, this thing has Gateway Key function built in, and you can change modes by hitting a button, although I don't have one bound right now. I also need some Abyssal Wasteland Essence, Dreadlands, and Omothal, so as I said, I needed a lot of this stuff. But yeah, it's it can get all the essences. It's at the highest tier, and it can also act as a Gateway Key, so it's awesome. I just needed to get that essence so I can get the Abyssal Nomicon, which... Uh, okay. Either way, I'd say our sparring match, although he seemed a little more nonchalant about it, just just, uh, just okay, let's just charge. <laughs> uh, I think it went kind of well. I mean, I did get to use my, uh, my, uh, my, uh, Kaikoku. I didn't go all out with, uh, the other weapons. Like, I didn't go all super slashy with my, uh, with my, uh, blade, and I didn't go all omni-slash with my red guitar. So, I, I think it went pretty well. You can apparently take him out with a Kaikoku in this version. But remember, uh, this, uh, is, uh, the version is not really complete when it comes to that. Because uh, later on, he's going to have some special attacks in later versions. So keep that in mind. This is not representative of his greater form. This is just a sparring match. It wasn't him while he was serious. Or, and as you could tell, I wasn't entirely serious either. It's just a casual fight to get a particular item as, as a reward for, for, for things that have happened. Uh, still doesn't seem to make up for the... Uh, Losses I had earlier. At com where did that go? Am I coming out the uh, coming out the wrong entrance because he blew a hole and stuff? Okay, there's where I was looking for. Uh, 
Uh, maybe I should just make myself a regular shovel. Hmm. Yeah, I don't need an expensive shovel. I just need a decent shovel for this. Because I'm going to have to shovel up all that Shogoth ooze and try again. I was right about the shadow creatures. Hi. This is the wrong spot for you guys. This is Omethal, not the Dark Realm. So you're not supposed to be the ones that are popping up around here. But I totally accept the the fact that you are. Uh, you're pretty you're spunky about it. Gotta be careful doing it at that angle, but it works. Yep, that's why again. Got to respread it all over again. Do I even need food? Because if I remember correctly, with this armor, I don't really need to have food. Because it just, uh... See, these guys are all over the place around here. Yeah, it's a ve they're very much, uh, uh, very avid here, despite the fact what I really need is uh, something entirely different. But at least I know that they'll show up with my little entrance there, so let me see here. Interesting items I'm getting, at least. Let's toss this in here. I'll keep the shuffle just for shoveling Shogoth ooze. Uh, hello, are there any Omethal ghouls? Please. Nope. Nope. Did you get switched around by any chance? Wait, where'd you go? Shadow monster? Did you think I went inside somehow? Where'd you go? Hello. Stabilizing. I gotta get used to the fact that I can stabilize that now. That's That's kind of new. Whenever I did the review, it was not like that. This is still... This is still weird. It's, it's no Omethal ghouls. At all. Really? Okay. That's it. I know how I'm going to end this episode. I'm going to leap off, go to the Dark Realm, and see if an Omethal ghoul shows up, not in Omethal, but in the Dark Realms. That's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to hop down to the next dimension and see if they show up right down there. That, that's what I'm going to do, because I'm, 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 I'm getting a little pattern here that they don't want to show up in the correct dimension, so I'm just going to leap for it. Okay. I'm just going to leap for it. So I'm going to just jump off and do it. Uh, I think I'll do it in the scenic region of the city. I'm going to leap off and go this way. So Wah! I also go somewhat slowly down because of the armor, but that's okay. Well, I can appreciate the view. Okay. <laughs> do 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 do. Oh, infinity. Do 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 infinity. I'm going to the dark realm. It's all nice and gloomy. I. Oh, ouch. That hurt. I was gonna say, I don't have to burn my eyes. I can just. go to a place that is roomy. Oh, yeah, that's, that, that, that was a good completion. Okay. Uh, Monolith Stone, so we are here at another Shogoth lair. Uh, I don't think they're being interdimensional with that spot. I think they just liked spawning there. Uh, dark stone is everywhere. Yeah, that's a, that's definitely a thing. Uh, you know, I might take my chances with abyssal blocks that are here. I might do it that way. 
Just see if I can Omphal Ghoul. Nope. Not that time. Any more Abyssal Blocks? I, 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 I can keep this up for a while. Why is it so eerily quiet around here? I mean, it was in Omethal, and there's like no caves for things to go to, so unlike the Dreadlands, that wouldn't make sense. Because in, in Omethal, it's a Skylands type thing. So if you go too low, there are no caves. There's just nice, empty passage to the next dimension. Hmm. Kind of like leaping off the ether. Hey, I know you guys. And you know me because I've been zipping you around here. Oh, you can't drain them here. That's a little uh, problematic for you. <laughs> because that's why I was letting you hang around. Okay. Is there any... any? Uh, there's, there's no uh, special structures around here at this time. I, uh, there will be in the future. There are plans. But there's plans to do more in Omethal first. Okay, so... I'm going to whoop you with a Staff of Rending. Wait, that's... Oh, those are Abyssal Anti-Ghouls. These are not the ghouls I'm looking for. <laughs> you are not the ghouls I'm looking for, I'm sorry. It's just, it's just not the way I was going with that. I needed to get a different ghoul. Uh, maybe I'll get one at random. Maybe I won't. I don't remember if... Uh, Omethal ghouls are something you can get from a, an abyssal block. I'm gonna have to do like a full run on these and just see if it works. Anti spider is. Hi. I have a feeling this just doesn't have enough room. Hmm. I just seriously get stone pickaxes from something? What did I get that from? Did did something just drop a stone pickaxe? Like seriously. Okay. So if I if I see a few more, I'll I'll hit them. Uh, if I don't, I might have to go around and try. Aha! Another one. Come on. Come on. I need the young with all ghouls. Please, gimme. Hey! There we go! Home with all ghouls! Thank you! I needed you so much! And there's like Shadow Beast, there's uh, Shogoth. This is a party! I mean, seriously, you guys are just, like, all over the place. So I'm just going to come down here and swat you all at once and grab all your stuff. Yeah! And by the way, this would not have worked any better on Jezahar than the sword, because Jezahar has a damage limit. Uh, so, so, yeah, there's that. Okay, let's see. Did I get what I needed, though? Please! Yes! I literally got one from that whole thing, but that's all I need. That's all I need, because I can EMC that. I can scan it into my system and take it. So I am, I'm, I'm, I'm grateful that that actually happened. So thank you. I also got some... Wait, was that a different Shogoth Flash? Was that, like, Shadow version? Yeah, that was Shadow. So I have the whole collection of, uh, of Shogoth Flash. That's nice. I have, like, the standard, Abyssal, Dreaded, Omethal, and Shadow. I've got it all. And on top of that, now I have uh, the Omethal Ghoul Flesh that I needed so much. So, you know, I'm going to make that upgrade right now. I I'm going to do that right now. So, I'm okay. So, let me see here. I have 21 Essence. It takes, like, 8 each. I'm going to need 8 of those. So, I'm going to take a stack of Omethal Ghoul Flesh. Okay. I'm going to grid this in. Jeep. Skin of Omethal. Wait, can I scan that? No. This is not the version that has the integration. That's another type. Okay. Upgrade to Omethal Necronomicon. Yes. Yes.
See, that scans. So, I, I'm very happy about that part. So, I can, in fact, do other upgrades. In fact, wait. I need to upgrade my bag, I think. Uh, or I can. I can upgrade it, but I... Okay, actually, I'm going to need a lot of room there, I think, because I think I'm going to probably want to empty it out first before I upgrade it, because I don't want to lose my crystals. Although I think I can just... You know, I'm going I'm to go ahead and risk it. I'm going to go ahead and risk it, because I know that those things I could... I, I could EMC before, so... I'm going to just go for it and see if I lose my crystals or not, because I, I got to know if in this version... Uh, that is accurate. So is that something I can do? Does it keep them all? Yes, it does. Sweet. Okay, I think there's like one final upgrade, maybe? Oh, no. Wrong. wrong thing I had to do that out of that menu uh, nope that is the final upgrade so I have my maximum size crystal bag and the next thing I need to do is to upgrade my Necronomicon to its final size or final t final form the abyssal nomicon yeah see how much does that take and does it require a sacrifice because I don't think so. Oh, I can do that right now. I, I have my Essence of the Gatekeeper. I have... I, I can do Eldritch Scales. Athaxium Ingots. So I can do that. Uh, okay. It has, like, it has, like, the rituals I can use, which is a lot. It, it can do, like, all the rituals, including ones that are exclusive to it. So let's do this. I'm just going to do the final ones here. Athaxium Ingots, please. One, two, three, four... Eldritch Scales. Two, three. I have my Essence of the Gatekeeper. So, let's do this final upgrade. The Abyssal Nomicon. Yes, I have it now. The final form of my Necronomicon has been made. I'm feeling so much better. I also think this lets me do all the information of how to do... See, nope, not that, not that, not not that. I needed to... Uh... Let me see here. What was it? Uh, for knowledge, was it machine... Yeah, materializer. Okay, yeah, this is where I get my materializer recipes, is whenever I get to Omethal, I get the book, then it gives me knowledge of how to do materializations, which is where you take crystals and you turn them into items. So it's, it's the reverse of using the crystallizer. Uh, and it's very cool. You actually have to put your book in the interface to do it because it's the thing that contains the knowledge. So this hyper-extended edition is where it really is at. And that's one of the reasons why you want it. Like, for example, the ability to create an Elytra like, yeah, it takes certain very specific crystallized elements, and but they're not really too hard to get a hold of, but you do need to get this book first. So that that shows what you need to get through to get, like, several copies of the Electra. So if you were trying to complete in a different way that, uh, 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 that item from Extra Utilities uh, too, like if you wanted to complete the Kaikoku because of the need for Electras, you could do it with Abyssal Craft as a way of getting more of them. So that is totally an option. And with that, I've done everything that I need to for now, although I can still do other things, have some maybe some specialized rituals and equipment done, because now I have my final version of the Necronomicon, so I'm very happy about that. Uh, so I, th I think, you know, as, as oddly quiet as it is here, I think I'm going to uh, hit off. Uh, oh, wait. Oh, there, there's a perfect overlook. Perfect overlook. Yeah, must do it this way. <laughs> oh, they spawn here better than they do on the ground. That, that's kind of funny. I, I, I see that. I see. I, I see that shadowy markings there. That 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 that's kind of fun. Wait, that's not. How does that work? Why is it all mobs around here have black smoke? Is that what's going on? 
For a moment, I thought that was a shadow creature of some sort. Really? Huh. Well, whatever. Uh, I mean, I, 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 I have, I've certainly found a, a, a landscape that's going to be easy to collect all sorts of those little things. Uh, so whenever I feel like collecting more of the set, I can just buzz around here because they're going to be easy to see against this, uh, against this uh, dark stone. But for now, I am heading off. So this has been uh, Glitch Reaper. I'm going to be logging off. Hope to hear from you all later. And bye for now, everybody.